Hey guys, so today I'm doing another three marker challenge, but this time I'm only using Copic markers. So I pre-did the drawing like I did last time, and I filmed the process of drawing it from beginning to lining it in the end. So there's that, and now I'm going to pick the markers. And I can't see into this bag, so... I guess I'm just gonna reach in and go for it. I'm gonna put the bag entrance towards you guys so that it doesn't look like I'm looking into the bag. And the first one is V00 Pale Heath, I think it's pronounced. The next one is W2, which is, oh guys, warm gray number two. Um, come on. And the last one is C18, which is copper. So, oh my god. Oh, what kind of colors did I just get stuck with? Um, so I guess I'll just go color it in now. I already drew the drawing, so I wouldn't be influenced by the colors I got. Not that this would have much influence on anyone, because it's a gray and incredibly... Oh my gosh, where's the swatch? I'm going to swatch these for you guys so you can see just how pale these are. Uh, I'll do it on the pocket in the back of my... Oh, I also got a new sketchbook. It's a little one. But it's a moleskin, and I really love it so far, so... And... Swatchy, swatchy, swatchy. Oh, God. So, all the Copics I have are Chows. And... I think I'll do another review for the Copics because I think that the first set I got was a little bit janky because so far these ones haven't had any problems, all the ones I have. Oh boy. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to redo the review. Maybe I'll do it while I'm doing this, so yeah. But anyway, these are the three colors. I mean, they don't, they're not bad for each other. They actually look pretty nice together, but we'll see how this goes. Oh, and. I will be using a colorless blender because it's three marker challenge, not three tool challenge, and other people use it in their three marker challenges, so I'm going to do it just so the colors will blend nicer because these aren't colors that will blend together well, or easily. So let's do this. So I show you guys the entire sketching process for this one. I'm not sure why. I guess it was just because I was having trouble coming up with ideas, so I just kind of started filming and to see where it went. So this is just me drawing it and I guess my camera ran out of memory or something because it didn't get the entire inking process. I mean you guys will see later that it didn't but it's kind of annoying because I really wanted to show you guys this from beginning to finish and the fact that it cut out was a little bit strange but I guess you guys will see in a minute. But yeah, I liked the drawing itself, and you guys will see the coloring, so stay tuned. So here I'm just showing you the complete drawing, and yeah, it came out a bit blurry. So now the coloring process. Um, not much to say about it. I like, so I'm just going to tell you that I like the Copics now. 
I don't know what was up with that batch of 12 that I got, but it didn't seem to work very well. But I am going to do a different video I decided for the Copic Marker Review. But yeah, I, I like how the coloring came out for this one. Uh, I always seem to end up with the gray in these things because I don't remember if you guys remember my last. I don't know if you guys remember my last um, 3 Marker Challenge video. But I had a gray in that one too. That one was a touch gray and not a um, Copic gray. So I only have one Copic gray, but I did like how this one turned out. The footage is a little bit blurry because my camera's not the best. I need to consider getting a new camera to film these things, but you can see what I'm doing, so I guess it works. But I decided to make her skin gray to make it seem more cat-like because she has cat ears and spots. So the spots were brown and her skin is gray and I like how it looks and then I made her hair brown too. But her ears are gray to match her skin and then her hair is brown to match the spots. But overall it's... I like how the coloring turned out. Um, there's a lot of detail in the hair if you look at it but you can't really tell in this because of how blurry the footage came out. But overall, I am happy with how this one came out. I think I'm happier with the last three marker challenge though because I like the drawing a bit better. But yeah, that I like it. So I am now done with the three marker challenge, Copic only. I might do a touch one. So yeah, this is the end result. I didn't end up using the color of the blender as much as I thought I would. Oh, and you can kind of see brown spots in the gray. Not those big ones. Those ones are obvious. But there are some in there because this one on the previous page bled through. So, yeah. It was kind of disappointing when that happened. But um, overall, I like how this turned out. Especially given that there's only three colors. So, yeah, and her eyes are not white, they are the purplish color, whatever that was. Um, it was V00, oh, and I realized yesterday I said C18, there's no such thing as C18, I don't think there's a C, there might be, I don't know. It's E18, and I was going over the footage, and yeah. So yeah, I hope you guys like this. I would love to start doing more art videos, so I guess we'll see where that goes. But until next time, which will hopefully be another art video, uh, bye and don't forget to subscribe and like this